If you don't know his name, now might be the time to learn. 18-year-old Denis Shapovalov is now the youngest player to advance to the semifinal of the Rogers Cup. But history has already been made. Yesterday's major upset over Rafael Nadal first got tennis fans talking. Nadal is not just the second-ranked player in the world, but a personal idol for Shapovalov. It's what I dreamed of uh, all my life growing up, playing guys like Rafa, Roger, Andy. Yes. Those who know Shapovalov say it was only a matter of time. I always thought he, he, he had a lot of potential, but to, 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 to be where he's at right now at this age, is, it's, it's kind of unreal. It's, it's, Adriano Foravia coached Shapovalo for nearly five years at his mother's tennis club north of Toronto. During that time, Shapovalo dominated his age group, winning last year's Wimbledon juniors. Foravia says Shapovalo represents a new wave of Canadian tennis players, inspired by the successes of Milos Raonic and Vasek Pospisil. All the younger guys are starting to believe that, hey, if they can do it, I can do it kind of thing. And I think it's it's kind of contagious. And now these you know these kids are doing it, and the next young level of juniors are doing it as well. So I think it's just kind of a you know everybody's jumping on the train now, the belief train. Some of that belief and maybe some pressure comes from the legends looking on. The great athletes want to be at center stage. You know they want to play under and be under that microscope. Uh, I think he has uh, ice in his veins. I think he's one of those guys going to love the pressure and take on that responsibility. That coolness under pressure is becoming Shapovalov's hallmark. He's building a reputation for being confident, unafraid to take risks. He's got his identity, he's got his game style. I mean, uh, he, he's, he's got the strokes to hurt and he's got the game, you know, that's uh, taking shape. But uh, he's got a lot of weapons and uh, I think he's always going to be a guy that uh, take his, takes it to the other guys. For now, his focus will be on the Rogers Cup, where he stands a chance to possibly face another idol, Roger Federer. Stephanie Skanderis, CBC News, Toronto.